With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Our question is if 1 upon 4 cn is equals to 1 upon 5 cn plus 1 upon 6 cn then find the value of n. Okay. So here 1 upon 4 c n we know that n c r is equals to n factorial upon r factorial into n minus r factorial. Okay. So I can write it as 1 upon here 4 c n. So it this can be written as 4 factorial upon n factorial into 4 minus n factorial. Okay. Is equals to 1 upon 5 factorial upon n factorial into 5 minus n factorial plus 1 upon 6 factorial upon n factorial into 6 minus n factorial okay so this can also be written as n factorial into 4 minus n factorial upon 4 factorial is equals to n factorial into 5 minus n factorial upon 5 factorial plus n factorial into 6 minus n factorial upon 6 factorial. Okay. So from here, from here n factorial I can cancel from every numerator because I can take this as common. So here, this is 4 factorial and 5 factorial can be written as 5 into 4 factorial. Okay. Okay. So if I can cancel 4 factorial and here, here I can cancel 5 factorial and this can be written as 5 into 4 factorial. So 4 factorial gets cancelled and the remaining part is 5. Similarly, from here, from here, here it is 6 factorial. 6 factorial can be written as 6 into 5 into 4 factorial. So 4 factorial can be cancelled. And the remaining part is 5 into 6. Okay. Similarly, here the numerator is 4 minus n factorial. Okay. So I can cancel this. And this can be written as 5 minus n. Okay. 5 minus n. And if I. Okay. So if I can also write it as 5 minus n into 4 minus n factorial. Okay. So the remaining part is after can cancelling this part. So I can write it as 5 minus n. Similarly, from here also, okay, so from here also, if I cancel this 4 minus n factorial, so the remaining part is 5 minus n into 6 minus n, okay, so here the remaining part is 1 is equals to 5 minus n upon 5 plus 5 minus n into 6 minus n upon 30, okay. Similarly, I can also write it as 1 is equals to 5 minus n and inside the bracket I can write 1 by 5 plus 6 minus n upon 30. Okay. So here on simplifying it I can write 1 is equals to 5 minus n into LCM is 30. Here I can write 6 plus 6 minus n. Okay. So this can also be written as after doing the cross multiplication, I can write it as 30 is equals to 5 minus n into 12 minus n. Okay. So here this can be written as 30 is equals to 60 minus 5 n minus 12 n plus n square. Okay. Okay. So this can also be written as this can also be written as n square. Here it is minus. 12 plus 5 is minus 12 minus 5 so I can take minus as common so 12 plus 5 is 17 so I can write here minus 17 and here it is plus 60 and in left side in left side there is plus 30 so I if I put it in right hand side this can be written as minus 30 which is equals to 0 okay so this can be written as n square minus 17 and plus 30 which is equals to 0 okay so on simplifying it i can also write it as n square minus 15 n minus 2 n plus 30 equals to 0 okay so on simplifying it more i can also write it as n into n minus 15 minus 2 into n minus 15 is equals to 0 from here i can take n minus 15 as common 
and the remaining part is n minus 2 is equals to 0 so if i put both these brackets as 0 from here i get n equals to 15 and from second bracket i get n equals to 2 but we know that here in ncr okay we know that here in ncr r should not be greater than n so i can say that i can say that n should not be okay n should not be greater than okay not greater than 4 so from here i can say n equals to 2 so this is not the answer so the right answer is option 4 that is 2 okay so thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today